Bryce, will you explain to me what the hell is going on? I would, but I know Arcadia is dying to tell you herself. I'm sorry for keeping it from you. So, that specimen there is Bryce. He's a demon hunter. I know. And he's immortal. Got that too. How nice to hear you speak so highly of me. We're not. Well, fine then. Anyway, he's been a demon hunter for the past five centuries, give or take. Hmm, that explains a few things. And demon hunters can defeat demons. But only if they're minions, that is. Minions? However, demon hunters can't carry out their work entirely by themselves. Yeah, we get awfully sad all by our lonesome. Normally, demons can't be defeated by typical physical attacks, with swords or guns, for example. But I saw him... Yes, but he's special. You got that right. But even Bryce can't defeat certain demons. Especially when it comes to the higher demons. They can interfere with our world to some extent, but they can't physically exist here. So that's why Bryce can't slice and dice them to his heart's content. Then how do you stop them? For that, we need a medium. A medium manifests demons into this world, which enables our demon hunters to fight them. When they're paired up, they're a formidable force to reckon with. And for Bryce, it was his wife. Wife? Was? Yes, 500 years ago. They fought the demon king Astaroth. Bryce, would you like to take it from here? It was a long time ago. Distant memory. To make a long story short, Astaroth won and took the life of Bryce's wife. Then the Demon King cursed Bryce and made him immortal. This left Bryce stranded with no medium, no way to defeat demons, and no way to die. And that's that. So, the reason why the museum where you were having your concert and the police station where Bryce took you was attacked. No, this can't be true. I'm afraid so. You're the next medium, the first in 500 years, since Bryce's wife. Are you sure? How would you know that? This is what we do at NADA. Investigate these very things. At the church, you were reading the memo. Then you saw Sangria in pain, didn't you? That's because you brought him physically into this world. That is your power, a medium's power. It was our job to try and find out who the medium was. Unfortunately, Bryce ran into you instead of me and stupidly handed you over to the police. So why are they after me? Because if you and Bryce partner up, the demons can be defeated. You're a threat to them. Meaning that they want to kill me, right? Don't be scared. We won't let that happen. Hello, Arcadia. We are ready for you. If you don't mind, could you bring the girl here? Yes, sir. Right away, sir. I merely need confirmation that you've defeated Sangria. Yes, sir. He won't be troubling us anymore. Those demons can be tough. I wouldn't want to send anyone in there only to find one of those creatures revived. I reduced him to ashes. I'm sure of it. Splendid. We're beginning to gain the upper hand. Right. The next thing to do is to bring Nikki to HQ. Understood, sir. Keep your wits about you, though. The town is swarming with demons. I can send some reinforcements for you, but I'm sure you can handle yourselves. You got that right. We won't let anything happen to her. Bryce, Nikki, are you ready? I'm not so sure about this. It'll be all right. You can trust us. Doesn't mess up my hair. 